Hello everybody. Um, I wanted to get this video out as quickly as possible to kind of uh, give you guys a um, an update, an update video. This is going to be an update video on what is to come um, for the very near future. I have started reading a book. Um, I got the Dr. Disrespect book recently in the mail. It's a signed copy, so I'm pretty proud of that, and it went with all my other uh, books of sports stars and signed copied books. Um, there is one in my uh, pantry because it's a cookbook that's signed as well, but the other sports books uh, and a red-green book it went with. Um, so I will be reading that because it did get me back into reading, finally, a book I found that actually makes me want to read. So I will be doing, finally, now that I've picked up a book and just dived into it, finally, I will be doing some book reviews coming to this channel, and I wanted to start a series called, because on Amazon Prime, I found a whole, like a, just a bunch of B-rated movies, or at least what I think are B-rated movies. So I think I'm going to start a new series called B-rated, and I'll probably put that in a different playlist from the reviews, just because um, my main reviews will obviously be uh, for the higher budget or better quality movies, I guess, um, and B-rated will be a series that I hope to continue, so I, w I will be doing it like B-rated, um, B-rated episode one, and I'll just title it as that, <clears throat> um, well, with the movie title in there too, obviously, because yeah, it wouldn't make much sense, but yeah, B-rated episode one, and then I'll put the movie title and where it came from. Um, but most of them will probably be from Prime Video, honestly, because that's where I found a lot of them. And maybe Tubi, because it's free, and I know it has a lot of uh, lower-budget movies. So I'm really looking forward to doing that, as well as um, Hero Month in June. And it may end up, I know I say in a lot of the videos, um, but because this will be become, this will be coming out long before any of the videos in June do, so, I got thinking about it the other day, and with everything that I want to fit into Hero Month with movies and TV shows, it may end up being a June and July thing, so we might have like a um, Hero Month 1.0 and 2.0 kind of thing, is what I was thinking, because I'm betting that June and July will probably be filled with nothing but hero movies and it's not just going to be all like superheroes obviously there's going to be um so like action heroes like rambo i'm hoping to do indiana jones uh blade would be another good one now that i'm thinking about it uh hmm what else could i do for hero month um, there's obviously a few TV series that I want to get. Uh, Netflix has a whole bunch, like The Punisher and Jessica Jones. I'm just looking at my shelf over there of all my stuff. Ooh, I could even maybe even throw in some anime series for Hero Month 2. Uh, Dragon Ball Z would be a good one to start over again. Um, I do have to start buying some more of the seasons. Because, yeah, I only ever ended up collecting to season four or five. I think maybe four, from the looks of it. And then I have Dragon Ball GT, and that's it. So I've got, really got to get my uh, anime collections going again, as far as that goes. Because I was so into it. So, so deep into it at one point in time, watching all those series like Bleach and Dragon Ball Z. And I had One Piece on the go. I was so many episodes into that. And then I just kind of stopped watching it. But I do like getting physical copies for all those shows because, yeah, it's just cool. I'm I'm a collector of certain things, so <clears throat> I believe I did I did do a video a long time ago about my collection. But anyhow, getting a little off topic here. The main point of this was just to kind of tell you guys about what is going to be coming over the next couple of months. And I was thinking about doing... Now, I don't know whether how I would go about this, but I want to do... I want to get my Patreon set up properly, so maybe I can do early releases on there. Or I was thinking maybe just keeping the books 
on Patreon if I can. If not, I might do it on OnlyFans. Now, I know OnlyFans isn't really... I'll see, we'll see how it goes. I might just do my one... I might just upload a book review and post it to see how it goes on there. And if it gets good feedback, I'll probably start... Uh, I'll probably put like a monthly subscription up um, for that. Uh, if you guys want to go see that over there. If, if Patreon doesn't l allow me to do it, I will do it on OnlyFans. Because I know OnlyFans has like a whole bunch of different creators and stuff out there. And it seems to be the platform to go um, for certain things. And uh, I was kind of thinking about doing reaction videos too. Because that seems to be kind of big. And maybe putting that over on there as well, because I know YouTube blocks a lot of the uh, reaction videos, and I don't know what the stipulations is, but it seems like a lot of reactors go over to Patreon or OnlyFans to do their content, because it's not getting blocked over there yet. So, I was thinking about doing that, because I do, I really am big into music, and I was kind of thinking about doing uh, album reviews as well, because Gojira just came up with a new one, so I'd like to do that. And uh, I believe The Offspring is coming out with a new album, and Lamp of God is coming out with a new album. Like, it's been a huge, uh, huge time for metal in the last year or so, and <clears throat> the reaction channel thing seems to be blowing up, so I was thinking about doing that as well. Um, just to kind of give you guys more content and a little bit, uh, you know, different stuff. I know, obviously, reviews are going to be kind of the same, but uh, yeah, at least, at least a more variety of content as to what I am reviewing, I suppose, uh, because I really do think that that would be good for this channel, and obviously good for you guys, because then it gives, um, it'll bring in more viewers of people who don't like the movies, they can see the books, or maybe the CDs, or albums, or whatever, however I am able to review them, um, and maybe I'll do, like, live reactions, too, on Patreon or OnlyFans, possibly, that's kind of what I was thinking. So we'll see where that goes. But that's kind of uh, my plans as far as um, the future of this channel goes. And I'm hoping to get that done as quickly as possible. Because right now I'm on a week off. So it's kind of been nice. I've been able to get some uh, stuff set up. And uh, see how my Patreon goes here in the next couple days. Because that's what I want to get done now. And we'll see where that goes. If I can do it on Patreon, I will. If not, then... Obviously, I'll have to do it over on OnlyFans and see how that goes, but we will see. I just wanted to bring that to you guys to let you know, and I will probably put this up on my front page for now until I have another update in the future, just because I like to kind of keep that page fresh, and the other video is obviously so old, and I've changed my um, ideas since then a little bit, so yeah, but we'll see. How this goes, uh, please comment down below if you have any other thoughts for something I could do. Um, obviously, movie or book or s music related wise, and uh, I will get back to you because I don't get that many comments. So, obviously, it's a smaller channel with a smaller community. So, if you do comment, I will be able to respond to you because you might be the only commenter. So, there you go. Um, so, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye bye for now.